we left some things out there last week, as you know, you guys heard us throughout the week talk about it. Um, we made some adjustments. We want to go out there with some energy, and, and uh, you know, we were focused all week, and um, you know, it was just great preparation. Went out there today and just had a blast. Um, you know, we emphasized having fun, and winning's fun, and our defense played well. So, um, you know, just a great execution by us. Uh, I mean that's exactly that. I mean that's exactly what it is. It's a 24-hour window, you know. Uh, that whole, you know, it's it's one game. Don't panic. You know, we we learned from that film. We watched it. We we spent the 24-hour window on it, and and we moved on from it. And you know, this team has been together long enough to where we've dealt with wins, we've dealt with losses. We learned how to do both. And um, you know, this coming out today just kind of shows, you know, what this team is about. You know, we took a. a Tough loss last week, but we were able to bounce back. And offense came to play, defense came to play, and so did the special teams. So we just want to continue with this momentum moving forward. As much as the defense gave the, the, the offense, you know, the team a chance to win last week, you were quick to point the finger at yourself, didn't take the ball away. Yeah. That obviously changed today, and it seemed pretty obvious right from the get-go how impressive you guys were going after. <coughs> Just talk about that mindset and that aspect of the game. You know, well, we, we talked about last week, you know, takeaways are a big part of the game. Um, you, you win the uh, takeaway, you win, you win a uh, turnover battle, then, you know, you're most likely going to win the football game. So, you know, we wanted to come out here this week and we wanted to do just that. Um, I'm not sure exactly how many takeaways we had, but there's a lot of fourth down stops and just defense getting off the field, and that's what we preached, and that's what we weren't able to do last week in the, in the second half. So, um, you know, we were just... Uh, you know, men on a mission this week, and and we went out, wanted to go, come down here and get a win. Mike, you guys had uh, two sacks on the first three plays. Both, both came out of the secondary. What can you say about uh, the, the job that Leslie Frazier did, kind of diagramming the game plan this week? Yeah, Frazier was yeah, Frazier was dialing it up, man. Um, there's a few times we came up the field, and I was I was uh, just dapping dapping Frazier up because it's just excellent calls, uh, mixing it up, sending sending guys. Um, you know, we were able to. Um, get a lot of pressure on first, second down, and also on third down. You know the, the guys up front were eating, so um, just an excellent job by Frage. And, and you know when we have that communication throughout the week of what calls we're going to make, and uh, whether it's first down, second down, third down, we we'll all have a good understanding from the coaches to the players. You know this is this is how we come out and execute, and this is how we play well. Did you always notice them get deflated as soon as two was knocked off the game? Did you ever sense that? Uh, uh, you don't want to say like you sense that, but you definitely want to continue to. Put pressure, you know, on the offense. Um, you know, understanding that they're starting quarterbacks out. Um, you know, the backup may have not got as many reps that week, so you just want to continue to put pressure on them, continue to, you know, show different looks and, and try to confuse them. And you know, I thought, I thought, <clears throat> you know, I thought our defense, you know, throughout the whole, we made adjustments throughout the game, and you know, it was just, it was an incredible way to bounce back after last week. And we, like I said earlier, we just want to continue that momentum. Jordan, wins are big in this league. Road wins are even bigger, and then road wins against the division. Yeah, it's big, but it, you know it's one game. Um, you know we want to continue, like I said, continue to carry that momentum into next week. Um, you know, obviously, anytime you get a win on the road in the division, it's huge. But like I said earlier, you know, a 24-hour window. You know, we got to learn from. You know, we didn't play perfect at all. There was still some ball, uh, some football um, left out there on the field that we can learn from and move forward and, and put our focus into Washington. Well, you know, honestly, we just focus on the game. Um, I, I, mean, I honestly didn't even know that we 6 0 against them last. I, I didn't even know that. Um, that's not something we talk about. We just talk about this game and who they who they got. Um, they got a lot of weapons on offense. We knew that coming in, so we had to find a way to to get pressure on the quarterback so we can limit their you know limit their weapons. So. Um, you know, we're just uh, fortunate enough to, to, to get win number one. Uh, we're thankful for that. But like Poe said, 24 hour window, we got to bounce back and move on to, to next week. As a, as a dog. As a dog. As, I mean, he's, a, he's a dog. A a pound for pound, just the best nickel in the league. Just dude, just comes to work every single day, just believing that he's the best. And I mean, he went out there, and to me, I mean, it was amazing watching him play today. You didn't even got to finish a sentence, but just the way he played today was incredible. It's incredible. Did he? 
that was a, a focus in the offseason, maybe getting a little bit more beef in that pass rush. Yeah, yeah, happy for Greg. Uh, you know, we got some guys, some big guys up front that can get out to the quarterback. So anytime we get up by a couple scores and, it, you know, force them to one-dimensional football, passing the football, um, you know, those guys up front are going to eat. So good for Greg, um, you know, and, and just happy to see those boys up there eating. No, no, I, I didn't know he had a couple sacks, but that's good, you know. Good for him coming back home and, and getting a couple sacks. When Singletary scores on the second snap and, uh, from scrimmage, how does that change things from you guys' perspective? How does it play with that early lead? Just got to keep pushing. You just, you know, the, the, it's a long football game. You know, regardless if they score on the second play or the you know, tenth play, you know, our defense still has to go out there and execute uh, at a high level and, and continue to keep pressure on them. Um, so it just gives us a joke, like, hey, let's go. Offense is moving. Like, you know, let's, let's, get, our, let's get our side of the football. Uh, moving too, and uh, you know today was a day where offense, defense, and special teams all came together, and uh, everybody was making plays. Can you guys put into words what it's like when you are riding uh, a wave like that defensively, getting out there, and that, maybe it takes a few series when you feel things are falling into place, but clearly, it, I mean, you, you look back and it seems as though this was just going to be your day. Uh, when do you feel that? And when does and what does that do for you? You know, honestly. Um, we felt like we felt during the week. Well, I think we were just so focused and the, the plan that we had in place, you know, the plan that coaches put together, um, you know, we, we, we felt it. We loved it. We loved the calls that Frazier was making throughout the week, and we knew that uh, once we get into the game, we had a clear understanding of, of what, they do, what they do and, and what we're going to do against them. So, um, you know, obviously the game comes rolling around. You know, you got the nerves. You know, you're not sure how you're going to perform, but, you know, it all starts during the week. And, and um, you know, I got to give it to coaches for putting a plan together that, that you know, that we can we can uh, play fast, play smart, and go out there and execute. Last one for Mike McClellan. Had so much history running this division. You guys won it last year. I think today you showed again. You guys have seen the beating division. I guess, how does that feel? And is it pride in kind of being it's one, game. one game at a time, man. One That's game, it. Buddy. That's it. One game at a time. Appreciate yep. you.